Hi, my name is Rene Martinez. I'm a guitar tech, also a guitar repairman. I started working with Stevie Ray Vaughan in 1985, and he attempted to uh, play so hard that sometimes he could break a string or not, and it was a normal thing to break a string, but someday uh, he was breaking more strings than ever before, one after the other. And so I had to come up with a, a solution for this problem, and I came up with it, and I found out what the problem was, and I'm going to show you, so help you prevent from breaking strings. So down here, as you can see, here is the, uh, the bridge for the Stratocaster, and these are called the saddles. These are six different little pieces here, and they're the saddles. And the strings will ride over the saddle, as you can see. And then they come through this hole here, and in this hole is this oblong hole for the saddle, but there's also another hole underneath it, which is uh, the bridge plate itself, and then the inertia block. And this is the place where the strings would get caught and break, down in here, and not necessarily here on the saddle itself. So here's a solution that I came up with. And at the time, I was using a insulation off a 12 gauge wire, and I would uh, peel it off, and it would be a sleeve of insulation, the vinyl piece, and that's what I would use. But this is different, this is a different material that I'm using today, it works far better. And uh, I'll show you what I did. I just grabbed this little piece and ran the string through it, like so, and then swung it all the way through and then it would come in and bring it down into the hole itself and then I'd come over and make sure that it didn't touch the saddle itself where the string rides over so it doesn't mute the string as you can see it does not there and that's that part right there will keep the string from breaking and then like normal you just go ahead and tune it up and I would tie the string here because it's very important don't put the string in the slot and then start turning tie it and that to ensure the string will not slip out in any way, shape, or form. And then once this is done, you can go ahead and have a true tight here and not have very many windings of the string. So if you look back here, the string has finally gone over the saddle and the part of insulation. And I'm going to do one more so you can actually see it again. So you get the piece of insulation and you run it through and then just hold on to it and pull the string through it put it down into the saddle hole or the hole of the bridge assembly and then there you go and then you redo the same thing tighten the string up at the top. So that's my trick for the day and this is a material now that you can get available through mojotone.com and eventually uh, it'll be on my site www.texasguitarwiz.com and that's wiz spelled with a w-h-i-z. Hope this helps.